hello to my take two video. If you like channel shout outs and you like to be recognized and thanked, you just keep watching because I do mega channel shout outs of all kinds and you don't even have to be a long time family member. Sometimes I am joining new families and I love their channel and I just shout them out and they don't even know that I exist yet. So keep watching. You've come to the right place. I have a little bit of something for everybody. And this one is a request that somebody wanted to know. How do you upload coloring pictures from a coloring app on your phone? Whoops, I didn't mean to. I mean, I meant to point to it, but I didn't mean. <laughs> you know what I mean, Jelly Bean. <laughs> and the thing is, is I am. Yes, I want to um, exit. Yes. Because I'm trying to do a tutorial, okay? All right. So there are different coloring apps. And I have, from the beginning, or since the beginning, learned how to put it in my editing app. And I make the coloring slow down so you can see the coloring process better. And I do voiceovers for channel shoutouts. So you can comment what you want me to color for your channel shout out or I just find something that suits your channel whether by your theme or your personality okay so I was using happy color but the thing is that one doesn't let you show the whole coloring process even if I slow it down so I am and I've tried other scents and they're not working well so I am using the tap coloring, the tap color pro, and that's what it looks like. And you want to just go to that. This one lets me, now it's not even going to open up. <laughs> um, it, it lets me show the full coloring process and you can speed it up or slow it down or just uh, upload it to your, your channel. So let's go. I have a whole bunch already, um, done. I have my paintings. And up here, it says in progress, completed, and light. I'm going to do completed. And I have mega, mega, mega amounts of coloring. And it's not just this coloring app. <laughs> Can I tell you? Um, there was other coloring apps that I used. Look at this. So, yes. I have used some of these for channel shout-ups. And I, I have more to upload. So, a lot is done, but not a lot is posted up to my unlisted uh, list for doing that. So I, I do dog ones for the dog coloring collab that I joined and you can check those out. Let's see, I am going to show you how to upload one. So you click on the one that you have. Then it has the options to save, share, or light. I liked this one. Um, you don't have to like them. I just started liking them. So you want to save it. So you're going to click save. Well, you're going to click save. And then you can save that one as a video or a picture. I always do video first. And then it shows it's generating the painting video. Now, mind you, when you are doing this on your phone, you have to have enough space um, on your phone, like for instance, if you have, see this one's not going too, too fast and I haven't even slowed it down, but isn't it pretty? But, uh, yeah, you need to make sure you have room. See, and it says video is saved. So then this is my old phone. I'm filming on my, uh, iPhone, which y'all know I have issues with because I can't pause it and there's today's date and the temperature 68. So, okay, so I went back to the main screen. Now, this is an Android phone I do this on, so it could be different for you. So here I go to my photos. Let me just get out of there because I, there might be things I don't want you to see. Okay, let's go down here. Um, and on my Android phone, I have a library. Let me try to get to the library. Okay, and I'm going to click the library. Let me see if I can show you this. Okay, so 
there are different categories. There's um, your camera, there's screenshots, and this one is the Tap Color Pro. So I want to take that, click it, and see it's here, and it's for today. I'm doing this, so I'm gonna click that, just touch it, and then up here, you wanna to touch it until you get the three dots. Again, this is an Android phone. So here you go, Android, and it's three dots. Three dots are your friend. So here you go. Now you have back it up now, edit it on, and that's what I use for editing. Edit in Video Guru, I guess you call it. Uh, I don't go right to that. I end up moving it to a folder. So here, I'm gonna go move to folder and I'm gonna have it go to my camera. And then it shows one item moved and you can view it if you <laughs> click it fast enough. So I'm gonna get back out of here and I'm gonna go back to my photos. Um, let's see. That's not, okay, so now I'm on tap coloring. I have so many in here. Okay, so now I have it in on my camera. So now I'm gonna to touch my camera. Well, no, I don't. I'm gonna show you how to do it without editing it. So it's on my camera, okay? So then, this is without editing the video, slowing it down, or doing voiceover. Just play around with this first, because that's what I did. So I'm going to go to my YouTube channel, and I am going to hit the plus sign. And currently it's on post, because I've been posting a lot of channel shares. And I'm going to do video. And here's the video that I want to upload. There it is. And then you click next. And there it is again. And click next again. And then it brings you to the page that hopefully you all are used to with uploading your pictures to, or your videos to uh, YouTube. Now I always have mine unlisted. If you take and click on that arrow, you can have it public, unlisted, private. I always just have it unlisted until I'm ready for it to be public. I have a lot in my unlisted thing, and then you can do schedule too, but that's not what we're teaching. So I have it unlisted, and then you can do your captions for your short, and always use hashtag shorts. That's the best thing for getting uh, traffic to your uh, videos. So let's see. I'm going to do, can't do it left handed. I don't want to lose you. Hold on. Bear with me. I'm going to do hashtag daily. Hopefully it's typing right. No, I got the K. Daily colorings not too bad with whoops Sharon and I can edit that later but I'm just trying to give you an idea so that's my open cloud that I have for everybody that wants to join just put in the hashtag coloring with Sharon daily colorings with an S um, and hosted by me, connection of lives and interests. And then it's still on listed and then you up hit upload the short and then it will upload. Now, if you want to see about editing, I guess I'll have to teach you about editing so that you can slow down the colorings and do voice overs as well. So maybe that will be in my next video. 
But either way, please comment below if you want to learn how to slow down these colorings and do a voiceover so I know who is interested. And then I can let y'all know. See, and there it is. It's ready to watch. There it is. And always give yourself a thumbs up, okay? It, it matters. And the paper clip means that it's not public. It doesn't have the earth on it. Okay, and there I am. I'm working towards my 5,000 YouTube family members. So if you're new here, I hope you will join my family because I love to get to know new people and I am shouting everybody out. Just check it out. I've got new ones all the time and I have 1,900 videos. And there's my About Me section, so be sure to check that out as well. Okay? I hope that you like this video. Welcome to Connection of Lives and Interests. And that you give me a thumbs up. And you join my channel by subscribing. And you hit that bell for notifications. Because you never know when I might shout you out next. Or do a tutorial that you need to learn something about. Or shout out your family and friends that are on YouTube and you want to let them know that, hey, Connection of Lives and Interests, they shouted your channel out. Go check them out. All right. Thanks for watching. Be kind. Be nice. Be encouraging. No matter where you are through the internet, we can touch lives. We can make a difference. We can make people smile, laugh, and give encouraging words. And remember, keep the fun in all you do. Thanks for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you.